Ready? Ready? Okay. Go. I declare this park a site open. Nice ticket, Council Scissors. <laughs> I'm very happy with the park. Uh, we had a lot of difficulty with health and safety standards and things like that because, you know, as it is, parkour is still establishing itself in the public mindset and um, it's seen because of the media that's, that's regularly put out to be, you know, a dramatic spectacle with a lot of risk and it's not like that at all but it's getting that message through to people. Well, so far I've had about 20 minutes to have a little play around, a little bit of movement. It's the first time in a little while I've used railings and things, but already my brain's buzzing with different possibilities. I'm still exploring now and I'm pretty excited to be honest. I like this park because there's a large array of challenges. Since I've been training here I've definitely got better at bar work and there's so many rail positions and stuff you can do. I think it's a really fantastic you know, opportunity for kids um, in the area to train somewhere for free. Have a facility that, that means they don't have to spend any money, it means they can just get out of their house, go down the road and yeah, have some fun racing. It would just be good to have more things like this around different areas so more people can, you know, like experience the same thing that's happening here because it's good for like community and kids and stuff. Not everyone wants to train in a really rigid form. People want to do, you know, bodyweight exercise and just experiment with movement and these spaces provide that and there aren't many places like it. So I really see, you know, going forward that a lot more people are going to want spaces like this to train and just have fun at and express themselves through movement.